All right, Saturday night, let's get into it. First, I wanna kinda tip my film hat to Jason Reitman, the director, because he did an amazing job on this film. Now, the film is about the very first Saturday Night Live show that aired on October 11th, 1975. And what this film is, it's this time period, hours before and leading up to the actual show. So it follows all the tension and the chaos and the angst, the fun, the laughs, um, the mishaps, and all the things that went on that day, hours before. And so it is a fast paced film. The cinematography is fast paced, which I know maybe some people I was reading, they didn't care for that. I loved it. I thought it was, it made me feel like I was in the moment and made me feel part of the chaos and the backstage and that feeling. So really great job. Now the performances, this is so difficult to do. So I want everyone to realize that when you take a group of iconic actors, comedians, and performers, and now that we love and that are just historically TV gold, television and film gold, and you now have to portray them. You are an actor and you now have to bring them to life in a way. And there was not one person that did not live up to the task at hand. And that is so amazing to me to be able to cast something the way that they did and then to pull off these iconic characters that we love. Now, everybody's in it that you can think of. They're representing Chevy Chase, Lauren Michaels, um, Jim Henson, all the people, you know, um, all the people that you would expect to be represented from that first episode, Gilda Radner, you name it. A couple of the standouts for me specifically was Lamorne Morris, who played Garrett Morris. I swear, when I saw him on screen, I'm like, wait a minute, is that Garrett Morris? Like, I really felt like I was watching Garrett Morris. He did such a phenomenal job. And then when I found out that his name, his last name was Morris, I'm like, oh, well, maybe they're related. That's why he was so amazing. Nope, no relation. This guy is just, oh, he's so talented. Really great job. And then the other person that I'm gonna tip a hat to is Nicholas Braun. You know him and you love him from Succession. I'm so glad to see him back on my screen. And he does not just play one role, he plays two. He plays Andy Kaufman and Jim Henson. And to me, I just wanna understand the thought process of anyone casting wise that said, let's just have Nicholas Braun play both characters. Because I actually looked at my sister Doring and I'm like, wait a minute, that's Nicholas Braun too. But it was so well done. It kind of made me feel like it was that Saturday Night Live cheekiness. And I'm here for it. Overall, a really great film. I was here for it. I know that it was super fast paced. There was also stories that I didn't know. There's this Billy Crystal story that I did not know um, about at all, which was which is kind of cool. And there was also some other, like what NBC thought about the show and how kind of ironic it all wound up being. And it, like even today, it's ironic. So go check it out. It's out in theaters now. I'm giving it a four out of five stars Saturday night.